Hello, my name is Abby and welcome back to Assetto Cursor. After two races I have won one silver and one bronze medal and so I need one additional silver and two additional bronze medals in order to complete the GT1 series and here then there is the McLaren MP4 12th GT3, the Mercedes SLS AMG GT3 and the P4 5 Competizione model 2011 and in this case I have to win three medals and I have three cars left I can drive and in this case I like to try to win one medal with each car and so I like to start this um, attempt with the McLaren MP4 12th GT3 at Mugello because I prefer Mugello over Silverstone and in this case without any further ado let me jump into my car and start the engine. Alrighty then, here we are at Mugello, one of my favorite racetracks, that's fantastic, that's really amazing. And yeah, I'm now driving the McLaren MP4 12th GT3 and this is a new challenge as before I was driving the BMW Z4 and so let me find out what this car is capable of and ooh, look at this fantastic futuristic cockpit design, that's amazing, that's really amazing. I like it, I like it. Ooh, had some serious wheel spin. All right, all right. So, the usual question. How to survive the first turn? Oh dear, oh dear, and it begins, and it begins. Hi. Oh dear, so many cars, so many cars. Yep, 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 getting sandwiched. All right. Okay. Phew. I don't like to be sandwiched. This is, this is always bad. It's never a good feeling. All right. Very close. All right. Wow. Where do you get your top speed from, guy? Hey guy, guy. All right. That's felt good. So. Wow. They are so fast. They're really fast. Wow. Every race at Mugello is so crazy and so demanding. I like it. I like it. I'm having a lot of fun and it's really cool that, well, it's, it's concerning that sometimes the AI is really strong and sometimes the AI is really weak. But yeah, I like it. I like it to really have some, some fights. I'm not so happy with that with the BMW M3 guy because this is a little bit stupid to have a car in the field that is basically unstoppable and you can't keep up with it but the rest this is really amazing to have really a, a good fight and yeah I think I need to 
focus more on the race because I like to win my second silver medal. I think here is the here's some potential to do this and so I hope that I can keep up with that guy and hopefully get him toward the end of the race or so would be fantastic Wow. They are so fast. It's so strange. Yeah, I, I don't know. Sometimes they are just starting away as if they get a speed bonus or so. I don't know what is going on with them, but it really seems as if they have a better acceleration or so. I don't know what what is up with them, but that's really, really strange to observe. Yeah, even now it seems as if he is pulling away and I'm behind him. I'm drafting or I should be drafting. Oh, this thing has only six gears. All right, all right. Ooh. That's close. That's really close, oh dear. All right. really a demanding race. It's so crazy, but also so much fun. Alright. Yes, yes, yes. Ow. He's taking revenge. He's angry. He's angry now. Who oh dear? Wow.
Where do you get your top speed from? I still can't understand why you... Why you're so fast. That's so crazy. How can you be so fast? Hi. Okay. Okay. All right. This race is crazy, this race is so exhausting and yeah, speaking of exhausting races, I saw that this P4 or 5 Competizione 2011 thing is at Spa. 8 laps race at Spa. This is, I don't know, a 30 minutes race or so? That's crazy. That's no, 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 no. You are not spinning me out this time, guy. You're not allowed to do this. Eight lap at Spa. Wow. This, uh, this will be really, really crazy. Oh, dear. Okay. This is so exhausting. And they are so close and so fast. It's It's so crazy. All right. Wow. This race is really <laughs> a crazy race and it's all the time here at Mugello that I have those crazy races and I think this is also why I 
like this racetrack so much because it's so much fun. Here's so many, so often the chance to have exciting races and exciting battles for a, for a place. That's really cool. All right, you. Last lap, last lap, finally. Finally the last lap. Wow, I'm exhausted, I'm completely exhausted. This race, this race was so crazy and yeah, I think once I start to edit this video I will notice that, wow, I haven't talked. I almost said, uh, I just said a few words or so, but yeah, this race was so demanding and the fight with the one car oh I get a fuel warning I get a fuel warning all right wow okay fuel warning that's interesting that's really interesting second place wow this was probably the most difficult second place I ever had wow wow what a crazy race what a crazy race and yeah, this DGFX guy with the BMW M3 is 41 seconds ahead of us. And yeah, look at the look at the gap. 41.6, 41.8, 42.5. So close, so close. That's incredible. All right, let us enjoy a bit the replay. Especially the start of the race was interesting. Um, the the first turn was crazy. All right. Yeah, and this BMW M3 guy is... I think he started from the pool position or so. That's not fair. He should start from last place. Okay. I'm in the middle, getting sandwiched. Yep, getting sandwiched. Fantastic, fantastic. <laughs> oh dear. Aha. Uh -huh. So crazy. Okay. I don't like being sandwiched. And this BMW M3 guy is pulling away, right away. He is leading the race and he was never seen again. That's crazy. It's really crazy. Okay. Did I get this BMW in front of me in this lap or 
Yeah, I think, I think. I'm on the inside indeed. I, I got him, I got him. This was good. And yeah, no, the long battle began, the long fight began. Um, yeah, there I'm quite close. Very close to the other car. Wow, so close. And was it my first attack or wasn't this a success? No, was not a success. All right. Um, what about this lap? Once again, very, very close. All right. Yes, yes. But then I was too wide and he had the inside. So there he got me again. Yeah, he had then over here he had once again the inside. So he managed to stay ahead of me. This was really a nice maneuver. This was really a nice fight. Okay, what's, what happened then? Once again, I'm very, very close. And I'm really impressed that this BMW was able to keep up with us. It was really amazing. Okay, this time... Yeah, this time he was white and I had the inside. So I managed to overtake him there. This was good. This was really good. And then we had somewhere a close call that... Was it over here that he wanted to spin me out? Could be. Very nice. Okay, um, let's take a look at the last lap, the last minutes, the last seconds, and yeah, so I'd like now to thank you for watching, I hope you have enjoyed this race in Assetto Cruiser, and I hope you will be joining me for the next race, when I will be racing or driving the Mercedes SLS AMG at... Imola or Monzer. So, yeah, until next time, my name is Abby. See you!